now we're going to talk about what are mixtures and solutions. For this lesson, students will determine which solids dissolve, they will define mixture and solution, and they will explain why some solids dissolve and some do not. We'll start off with a little experiment. The procedure is listed up on the smart board. They'll fill, they'll half fill each container with water. We'll put one spoonful of sand in one container, stir the mixture for one minute, and then repeat steps two and three using salt, sugar, and baking soda. At the student's desk, they'll have this exact graphic organizer with the sand, salt, sugar, and baking soda. They'll need to record what happens before stirring and then after stirring what happens by clicking the question mark. There is additional questions at the end. Which solid, solid dissolved the fastest? Which one did not dissolve at all? Now we're going to talk just about mixtures. Once again, you can in, in, um, record your own voice and then link that to the smart board. Do you like salad? Salad is a mixture. A mixture is two or more substances that are combined without being changed. Even though it's the same as you would be talking in a lesson, just by um, incorporating that sound effect, students really get their attention. Oh, it's talking, they want you to replay it, so it's kind of a fun feature. Next, we have an example of a mixture. By clicking on the question mark, you'll, you're able to give additional information, and a mixture substance can be separated from one another. For example, the granola, if you don't like raisins in your granola, you can simply just take them out. So that gives a good picture and example of a mixture. Not all mixtures are made of solids. Now we talk about salt water and how that mixture can be separated. 